Okay, so let's link the two. Let's link the session view and the arrangement view. Here's what I've done. I've got a couple of pieces of audio that I've added. This is the first one. I'm going to stop all clips for one thing. I see those green clips there. I'm going to stop those all by hitting the stop clips. And let's audition this clip here. Now, I only like this part of it, so I'm going to take the loop brace and move it directly up here, just like this. And maybe move back a little bit. All right, that's good enough. Now, this is just a regular kick drum. And the problem is, is that I want it to loop at 120 beats per minute. So in the clip viewer, I'm going to simply say warp. Now warp is something that we're going to get into at length, but suffice it to say that if I don't have warp on, then I can't get the loop button. So I have to put warp on so that I can get the loop button. Now let's hear this clip. Okay. And I want to check this with my metronome, so I'm going to do this right here. Okay, it's off, so I need to adjust this loop point right here. Okay, and now I'm at 120 beats per minute, so I just fixed this verse using the metronome. All right. Now, what I want to do is stop the transport. You can see that it's going 58, 59, blah, blah, blah. And that has to do with the arrangement view, all right? And sure enough, if I hit my follow clip, I'm all the way up to 58 right here. So what I want to do is take it all the way back to the beginning. I can do it there. And I want to make sure for the next session that this is not on. If I have this on, this is a loop point. And because what we're going to do is record our moves from session to arrange. And here's how I'm going to do it. I'm going to hit this button right now, and I will be recording from this moment out. Here we go. Watch this. And I'm going to go to this second clip and I'm going to touch this and I'm going to use my arrow keys right. Okay, just like that. And then this is the start point. Okay, fill out a sync there a little bit. Okay, now I stop. Now for good or bad, that particular one didn't have any bright moments, but who cares? For good or bad, ding, I just recorded all that. I'm going to hit my plus sign. Plus and minus is scroll up and scroll down in the arrangement. OK, now when I go to my tracks here, I have, in fact, clip views now because I have media within my clips on my arrangement. Okay, so this is not a bad section right here. Solo it. And what I'm going to do is complete the circle. I'm going to select this, copy, go to session view, go to the very next clip slot, right click, paste. There's the original, there's the new one. Okay, and this can happen over and over again with whatever you've got.
Okay, so that is recording from the session view to the arrangement view.